Hey friends, we're the Nixon Pack. We're realtors, home designers. And DIYers. And today we're talking about just that DIY. You know what I heard the other day, which was kind of cool? There are either DIYers or DI buyers. Which one are you? Have you heard that? No, but I, I know where we are. You wish you were a DI buyer. Yeah, it's You're not always DIY. the finances that if you can't afford it or can afford it, it's really if you can control or if you want to work around your timetable. Gratification. There's and, nothing like doing it yourself. And so let me, let's me let mention that. When you hire a contractor and you're going to do a project and you tell people you're the DIYer, and you're not technically, but that's fine, you have to commit that those people are going to be in your house for, if they say it's going to be three weeks, it's going to be five weeks. Uh, always if they say it's going to be for X more time. price, it's not going to be. There's always things that end up. And not up. to anybody's fault. That's just, that is the, the whole, you mm -hmm. know, thing behind home renovations. That's uh, the unexpected always comes up. So that's the number one rule. Plan, mm -hmm. don't plan a timeline. P give yourself a little bit of fluff. So if Kaylee asks, when can we do a bathroom? I say in two weeks, how long will it take? I might be able to get it done in three, but I'm going to say five because I'd rather overperform. Yes and under promise. Yes, and you always do that and you always come through. So now I've kind of like started, you know, taking in the timeline. But we are about to tackle a couple of bathrooms at once. And this is something that, you know, is a huge undertaking. So it doesn't have to be a few bathrooms. If you're even doing one bathroom or if you're doing a kitchen, you wanna make sure you take steps ahead of time before you even, you know, sledgehammer. Because we get excited, we run in there and we just like take down all the tile. But you wanna have all of your supplies purchased ahead of time. Before you do any of the demo, you want every single piece of tile. You want the grout even. What else do we need? You need everything in the garage. Tools buy a little extra. If you're going to go to your big box store, it's okay. Keep the receipt. You can return it when the project's over. But just driving to the hardware store three times on a Saturday, say you're doing it on the weekend, adds up with time going back and forth. So have some extra materials there. If you're fortunate enough to have two bathrooms, then you have the other one that you can use. But if you're using that one bathroom, for example, pull items out that you can live with ha not having. Let's just get to it. Leave the toilet as long as you can or borrow one of those portable ones from your old grandparent that they have from the hospital bed. Anyway, that's where You've the bathroom. Done that. Yeah. You've done that. But even with the kitchen, do a makeshift kitchen in your dining room because this is going to be a really big source of stress, a big source of dust. So if you can, take those sheets, the clear plastic, tape off as many rooms as you can, cover furniture. We took a big project on where we did all of the trim work in this house and we hand sanded every single piece of wood. You couldn't imagine the dust that ensued. So if you are able to give yourself the gift of having a professional cleaning company come in after, it's going to feel like a brand new house and it is well worth the money. That's spent. a great point. Also, when you're doing it, you don't think about food. For example, if you're in the kitchen, yes, it's going to affect your dinners, your breakfast, your lunches. If you're not, you're in the bathroom, the living room, it's still going to affect your meals. The reason why is if you're doing that project after work or on the weekends, Food takes a back seat. So just make sure and know that you're going to end up budgeting some extra money in just to feed yourself. I love that point. How do you guys get through a renovation? Comment below. We would love to chat with you and share our war stories from renovations yes. gone wrong. We can't wait to see you for next week's Nixon Pack Nugget. And hey, if you haven't seen it yet, you've got to check out Walkthrough Wednesday. We take you on a house tour every single week. And we love sharing Nixon Pack Nuggets with you. Real estate, DIYs, renovations, the works. We can't wait to see you over on the Nixon Pack channel.